We are back with more of My Southern Home, and I'm here with Hannah Shellnut with Shellnut Insurance. And Hannah, thanks for being on the show. Thanks for having me. I'm excited to be here. So it means a lot to me that you spent time with me today because I've always wanted to talk about home insurance on the show because it is so important when a tragedy happens in your home. And that's what you provide people every single day. Correct. Um, homeowner's insurance is so important because it does protect you from those things we can't control, like tornadoes, hail storms, lightning storms, all of that. Um, it also, what some people don't realize, it also provides you um, legal help. So if someone were to get hurt on your property, um, there is liability coverage there as well. So super important to have, and obviously it's most important to have the right policy um, for you and your family. And so let's talk about the right policy for a little bit because most people like me, you get your homeowner's insurance and then you really don't think about it for years, right. but you add to your home and you add items to your home. So how often should you consider updating your homeowner's insurance? Yeah, we usually recommend that all of our clients just look over their policies every year. That doesn't necessarily mean that any changes need to be made, um, but for example, say your house burned down today versus 2019, the rebuild of that home is gonna look drastically different with all of the inflation that we've had. So just kind of knowing what's going on every year, just like double checking your numbers, that's great. But like you said, any additions to your house, maybe you build a pool in the backyard, Maybe it was just Christmas and you got a new toy, like a boat or a, a new piece of jewelry. Those types of things um, you do need to contact your agent about because more than likely your policy will need to be updated or you might need an additional rider. Um, that is why we really encourage local agents too because you're not dialing an 800 number trying to get the right person when you build that pool in the backyard. You have a local agent, you call your agent, you speak to them on the phone. Um, and that's what we really try to um, promote at Shellnut Insurance is that client-agent relationship. Well, that's really important because that relationship that you have with your agent is going to ensure that you have the right policy and they're asking the right questions because they know you versus someone on the phone that doesn't really know the home that you live in. Exactly, and that's the importance of having a, the right policy for you because insurance is protecting your assets and no one has the same assets so it is important for you to talk about your life with your agent so that they know that you're covered and you feel confident that there are no uh, strings untied. Hannah what does a basic home insurance policy cover? So your home insurance policy is going to cover you for things that are out of your control like uh, fire, tornadoes, hailstorms, lightning storms, things like that. It also gives you liability coverage if someone is injured on your property. Um, but there also are additional riders that you can add on to your policy for special things like jewelry, guns, um, nice art pieces that will be in your house. Maybe you have a nice fur coat. Um, your home insurance policy will cover those things up to a certain limit. So it's important that you review your policy, you know that limit, and then if you have any valuables that are above that limit, that's when you would want to add a rider onto your policy just to make sure everything um, is fully covered under that policy. And Hannah, what about items such as a drainage leak or flooding in the home? Yeah, um, you can get an additional rider put onto your policy. It will also help extend the amount that you're going to get back. So your own insurance policy is going to cover basic things um, and up to a certain price point. Uh, but it is important to look at inflation and how much it would cost to build an area of your home back if it were destroyed by water. So adding that additional rider onto that would keep you fully protected. So a rider for those at home that aren't familiar with these terms and they just go to their insurance agent and they trust that that person is taking care of them, which I'm sure that they are. A rider is kind of like a la carte policies that you could add on to your basic policy, right? Exactly. So like uh, me personally, um, we have like a rider for jewelry. We don't have a golf cart or any extra toys in the home, so we don't need that much coverage, um, but you can just get one for jewelry if you want. 
Um, if you have, if you just love art and you have beautiful pieces on your wall, you can get one just for fine art. So it really is tailored to your needs, which again is so important to have a local agent that knows you so that they can um, ask those right questions because you might not even know to ask, hey, should this be covered or am I good with it just hanging on the wall? Is it covered by my policy? So having someone local to ask that knows you, really they're able to ask you questions as well as you ask them questions just to make sure everything is properly covered. Well, that is so true because the agent that I use noticed that my policy hadn't been updated since I bought my condo in 2005. <laughs> <laughs> so Easy to forget about. <laughs> yes, yes. Well, I mean, you just go through your daily life and you don't think about it and all of a sudden 20 years pass mm -hmm. and you change the floor and you change the kitchen and you've changed all these items in your home. And if a tragedy happens, which, you know, it did in my case, and thankfully my agent had updated my policy. Yes. And that's the difference between who you use. I mean, it's really important to have the right person, the right company, ensuring the items are important to you. Absolutely. Um, and that's why it's so great to work with someone local because they are there. They can come even look at your property if need be. Um, especially with an independent agent too, something that's unique about an independent agent is that they have multiple options. Um, so if they, you reviewed your policy and you wanted to update it and the price wasn't right or they, they just weren't a good fit company, um, Shellnut Insurance actually writes through 20 different companies. So an independent agent can really give you options when it comes to having coverage on your home. Oh, that's good to know. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you so much, Hina. Yeah. We really appreciated it. Thank you. I appreciate your time. We'll be back with more My Southern Home in just a moment. Mm -hmm.